Hello everyone, welcome to a new video on the channel, welcome to some more Eliminator, and of course, of course, of course, I had to do the part 2 to the other video that I've done, which was using only odd cars, and by odd I mean, I don't mean strange cars, but I mean like the odd number of cars in, uh, in their specific levels, so 1, 3, 5, 7, and 9, and now I'm only allowed to use 2, 4, 6, and 8. The only car that I'm able to use that's level 1 right now is this car. So that is the, the starter car. I have to change to a level 2 car as soon as I possibly can, right? So as soon as I can, I have to get to a level 2 car. And then from then on, that should stay as my car. Or I can only update to a level 4, to a level 6, to a level 8, to a level 10. So, that is the goal for today's video. Can I win with the even number leveled cars i guess if that makes sense or even leveled numbered cars whatever it is <clears throat> there's a drop right next to me so that's good uh i should probably spawn on that little bit more often because i think there's there's one there there's one to my right as well a drop that's level five i can't take that i'm going to the right i can't take the level five There's the people to my right as well. What's this? Level 3? I can't take that either. I had to. I had to challenge him. I had to get off this car. So whatever level 2 I get right now, I need to. I need to get to level 2. You know what I mean? Oh, he's left. This is brilliant. This is fantastic. Alright, we have to take the escort. Any way possible, I have to go to level 2. Okay, so now I'm in the correct car to start this game off with. That was good. That was a good start. What's this? Level 4? No. It's a McCann. It is a McCann. I can't race that guy that's in the F-150 because I can't then take his F-150 if I do race him. So I'm kind of stuck in this car for now until I see a level 4. Either driving around that I can race, or level 6, whatever, or 8, or 10. Unless I see those guys driving around, or I see a drop. So this is a... It's, I really, really like this challenge, because it basically stops you from taking half of the cars. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> Why? Why this time around? Why this time around when I'm doing this challenge? There's so many of these odd numbered cars about the place. Oh, it's so annoying. <laughs> it's so annoying. Okay, he's driving a McCann. There's no point. There's no point. There's no point. I have to drive away. I literally have to drive away. It'll be a waste of time for me to race him because I, I can't take his car anyway, so it doesn't matter. And I can't take that car either. The, I, I couldn't even try to challenge the the McCann anyway. Because the McCann was the same. Probably should have taken the golf. Should I take the golf? <coughs> Did you guys see what I just saw? Did you guys see what I just saw? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Okay. Oh god. Oh god, it's over. <laughs> oh no, this is over. I'm done. I am I'm finished here. There's no way I can win this. This guy really has to mess up. Like, really badly has to mess up for me to win this. I cannot go faster either. Like, this is this is as fast as I can go. Come on. Come on, game. Okay. I definitely chose the right path here. Compared to him. Oh my god, please. Please, 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 please. I'm gonna cry if I get this. Oh, 
See, that was a good challenge for me to try and race him because he's in the car that I can actually take. Oh my god, no way. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, boys. Oh no. <laughs> There's a way. There's a way I beat that guy. Oh, that is, first of all, unfortunate for that guy. But also, he should have known better. You don't just climb up on the mountain. Come on. There's ways around everything. You don't have to drive into the mountain. You don't have to drive in a straight line. It's not always the fastest route. I'm still going to look for drops, though, because if I get level 10, I mean, I'm pretty much sorted. But it's going to be very rare. Or level 8, obviously, as well, because I'm still not... It's only level 6. Even though the RS, uh, RS7 is very, very good. I hope that guy was just glitched and he wasn't actually cheating. <laughs> could you imagine? Could you imagine if that guy in the prior was just straight up cheating? Uh, can't tell what this guy's driving. Focus, I don't care for the focus. I don't care for that guy either. I guess the only thing I can do now is try to eliminate people. But I really like the RS7. And I kind of don't want to ruin it by... By losing to someone that's a much lower level than I am. Let me have a look at the... At where the next zone is going to be. Okay, the next zone is going to be pretty much here where I am. This is going to be the, the center of the circle. So I'm going to go all out just this way. So when people finish their races, there's a bunch of people behind me. Which the finish line should probably get put around where I am. Um, let's get some drops over here as well. I kind of want to have a look at these lot. Let's see what's happening here. Hmm. I mean, since that guy avoided one of them, I think he, he came over here. Or are these the ones that I looked at before? Yeah, this, these are the, the two drops I ended up looking at before. Yeah, I completely forgot. Okay, so I have a hacker in my game. I literally have a cheater in my game. Should I try and eliminate him? I really want to try and eliminate this guy. He's here. No, come here, come here, come here, come here. I want to try and beat this hacker. He keeps sending himself, like, really, really far. He keeps messing up. Oh. Yeah, yeah, come here. I can't wait for him to just shoot himself across the map. Yeah, there he goes. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, this is way too funny. This is way too funny. <laughs> this is the first time using cheese. It has to be his first time. Oh, he's just terrible at it. There's way too many bumps and things. Surely it's not even that hard. You just point yourself in the direction you want to go and that's it. Oh man, if I beat this guy, I'll have the perfect title and thumbnail. That guy sucks. Oh, that guy is so bad. Seb Cool143, you fucking idiot. <laughs> you absolute brain dead. Oh my god. I can't believe I beat a hacker like that. <laughs> what an idiot. What an absolute idiot. Oh, that was so good. I can't believe doing this challenge. I can't believe doing this challenge, I somehow managed to beat a hacker with it as well. Just, just randomly. How is he so bad? I saw him in a Ferrari. Like a, a level 7 Ferrari. So I'm guessing, does he, does he like just pick where he wants to spawn? Like does he know where the spawns are? Or something? Because he spawned on that. Surely, right? 
Because he had that at the very beginning of the game. I saw him when he shot himself across the map in the Ferrari. And, uh, yeah, I wonder if, like, that is a thing. Or maybe he just got lucky and got that Ferrari. But obviously, he didn't, didn't really want it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go over in this direction because of where the area is going to be. I'm not 100% sure where the final zone is going to be. Probably behind me somewhere because that, that's what makes sense. But, I mean, the game is, isn't always about making sense. <laughs> Sometimes you will get placed... Or the finish line will get placed in areas where you just least expect it. So, interestingly enough, I need to try and be careful here. With my positioning. I kind of want to put myself somewhere over here, though, for when I'm racing. So if someone comes along my way over here... Is this anything interesting? Nah, for Bronco. I feel like that could attract people. No, the Bronco. Or at least someone's finish line is going to be somewhere around here where I am. I'm still not far enough back. I should go back more. The reason why I want to go back as far as possible is because I don't want the finish line to be... Like, if someone challenges me to a race, or I challenge someone to a race, I don't want the finish line to be, like, sideways. I know I can sort of pick where the finish line is going to be with the positioning of my car. You know? Where, so where the start is compared to where the finish is. So if I'm more at the se center of this circle where I was... There's a much higher chance that the finish line will be pretty much in a random direction, you know? But if I'm here, the finish line can't be like here, for example, or here. That has to put it in an area over here, you know what I mean? So that's why I'm... That's why when I'm playing like this, I, I pick sort of where the finish line is going to be. Um, by positioning myself at the very beginning. Close to the edge of the circle. It's still not 100%. In this game, it was 100% in uh, Horizon 4. I remember in Horizon 4, it was much more, much more, uh, I guess, st like straight and clean with you of where the finish line is going to be. But in this game, it just feels like it's a little bit random. Again, finish line here, like the main finish line of the, the, the final circle could literally be anywhere. It could be on the other side of the map. It could be just down south here. It could literally be even up on the mountains here, which... It would be kind of annoying to, to place it over there, but I'm gonna wait here. I think I'm gonna play this tactically, especially since I can't level up my car regularly just by racing people. I'm gonna play this nice and nice and tactical for this, so I can try see if I can win this. Okay, here's the final showdown. I'm gonna try position myself close to to this end of the circle here, which is close to where the road on the highway is. I'm going to try to put myself somewhere here. Or at least try to like, full speed towards it. Okay. Okay. It's not going to be on the highway, unfortunately. Okay, let's just, I'm just going to go like this, from this angle. It's pretty much open fields here, so I don't really have much to... Much to avoid, or... Or avoid, I guess. I don't think I'm winning this one. People have so much better vehicles than I do. I mean, I'm stuck in this level 6, however... And even the terrain is actually not, yeah, I know. I was about to say, however, I kind of know the map a little bit better, I guess. Probably compared to the, all these lot, but... I don't know if that's enough. See what I mean? Like, level 9s would slaughter me here. Like, there's no... There's no chance I'm winning this, I don't think. Uh, I need to be careful here, because I think there's, there's walls around the city. I was gonna say, we have to try go around him. Oh no, I did the same thing that that guy did as well. <laughs> no! Oh yeah, third. Oh, we'll take it, you know what, I'll take it. 
<laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> At least they booted the hacker out of the game. That was the best thing ever. I can't believe that happened. <laughs> I kicked him out of the game so quickly. That was jokes. Third place, though. Third place isn't bad at all. I mean, we got a good car. Like, the RS7 was good. And I kind of wasn't really scared about racing anybody with it. Anyway. We'll try one more time. See if I get as lucky in the, in the, next, in the next one. Okay, we try again. I'm going to spawn here again. Now, I probably will have people asking, or especially new people to the game, like, why am I spawning there? That's practically the center of the circle. Of the map, pretty much, so... If I spawn there, I can go literally anywhere on the map that I have to go, right? Because it's the center. So it's it's better to spawn there than to spawn somewhere on the beach miles away. And first of all, there's not going to be anybody there at all. And there probably will be less drops as well. See, this time around, there's no drop here. But that's okay. I need to race someone anyway. I either need to race someone... What the hell? I either need to race someone or I need to get a drop instantly. Because again, we're doing the, the even cur thing. Okay, the zone's gonna be to our left here. There's a the guy in the highway. There's someone getting that, by the way, so that's why I'm not going over there. Probably should have raced that guy. Okay, those guys started racing each other. This guy is driving away from me for whatever reason. Yeah, I need to get off this car with, uh, with the level 2 car. Okay, someone is behind me. In a Naudi. I can't take that. I can't take his Audi if I win. Which I'm probably not going to because I think it's so much faster than this. Well, that didn't go great. <laughs> right, anyway, I think I'll leave the video there for for this time for the time being. Uh, that was a good first first uh, first game as well, so. I don't really mind ending the video there. I cannot believe I beat that guy. That was the funniest thing ever. He's definitely a, like a beginner to this. Like he was trying to send himself whilst the terrain wasn't even. I don't know if you could, can you change the amount of like boost you get and stuff like that? So like you don't send yourself, I don't even know. I don't care to be completely honest with you. Just the fact that I absolutely annihilated him made it even funnier. Anyway. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you want to see more videos like this on the channel, uh, please subscribe. And I'm definitely down to try some more challenges for uh, for the Eliminator. So if you have any of those, leave them either down below or in the Discord. And I'll read the comments pretty much anywhere for uh, for trying some new challenges on the old, on the old um, Eliminator. But anyway, that's it. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.